Hello everyone, this is Jebro, and I've decided to put a little webcam on to see how well it works. Um, so yeah, hello. Um, <laughs> so basically, uh, this is the Magic Find, uh, sorry, Reward Track video for SPVP. I'm kind of doing this a bit live as well, um, just in one go. So I'm also trying the webcam just so you can see my face and my reactions if I actually get anything good. Um, Hopefully that happens. Um, so basically I have many, 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 many buffs. Birthday, gift, uh, booster thing, the 30% um, laurel magic find pot, the outnumbered in World v World, which also gives you extra stuff. Um, all the other standards. I've done this video a few times, so I don't need to explain again how many buffs I've got and stuff. So I'm going to go through and I'm actually going to open these crates. Now these crates were from the Inquest Crucible of Eternity or whatever it's called um, and I'm going to open them now I'm going to double check to make sure that is the right one because I've done so many bloody reward tracks I can't actually remember I've just done uh, I've done uh, CM so I'll do, that'll be the next one yeah Crucible of Eternity is the one that I've actually just done so I'm going to open them now um, I didn't buy any uh, salvage kits or anything so I'm going to just quickly run over here I'm going to refresh this as well just because I'm going to um, but as you can see, I did get used to this spicy pumpkin um, food as well, to co cookies, sorry, to get the actual uh, things that I wanted. And I'm apparently being special because I can't find a, just a normal merchant. That's really fun times. Okay, right, so I'm going to use that. Gonna use that. I might sell some stuff as well because sometimes I keep changing my mind about how I'm going to use the mats. So I'm going to start with the Inquest Engineer loot boxes. So guys, if you haven't opened a reward track before and this is the first video you're doing, this SPVP gives reward tracks now. When you get um, wins or losses, you get uh, completion in each tier and um, basically you can get rewards. And Magic Find actually affects the chests. In PvE it doesn't, but in PvP it does, because each of these chests actually represents some kind of boss or a mob, like a veteran or a champ, like it says their champion destroyer, it would be like a champion um, that you would have looted from. So you get bags or you get loot or you get whatever. Um, so I'm going to basically just start opening boxes. This is everything. These are also two level rank up um, boxes that I got. I think I got two levels ish during the uh, actual uh, quick, just while I was doing the actual reward track itself. So I kind of chucked them in as well. And these cases are weapon boxes and stuff. So they're actually from the actual dungeon itself. So it's mainly these ones we're looking at here because these are predictable. You know what you're getting from these. You can just choose. Um, and you pretty much know what you're getting from them other than the actual little bags themselves. So I'm going to start with the. Um, the engineer loot boxes and we're gonna just keep going from there. So here we go. See if we get anything lucky. Da, da, da. I can't see anything there so far. Just really just basic stuff, greens that you can sell. Just uh, whites there. Oh, got a rare. Nice. Um, you see my face. <laughs> I got another rare there. Just looked at my face and was like uh, come on, let's get something nice and special now, this time. This is getting rares, getting a lot of rares actually. Uh, a lot of those elaborate totems as well. I'm looking at the right side because it's easier to actually see what you get. Uh, da, da, da. A lot of greens again. Scroll of knowledge, green. Visible scrap. Right, so okay, we're coming to the last of those ones. So knowledge crystals, you do, you're actually going to get, it's nice that you get those... Um, those tokens as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to quickly compact everything, just in case I uh, actually do miss something. Um, not sure why that's just gone down there, to be honest. But hey ho, we'll just stick that there. Um, right, so I'm going to start off with these bigger chests. Now these are the veterans and whatnot. So hopefully we'll get something a bit nicer. So you get the Dulux box there, the green Dulux box. That's where we're going to be getting some of the nicer loot, I think, really. Uh, da, da, da. Oh god! Oh my god! I thought <laughs> for some reason I just I was just thinking, oh my god, that's that's going to be a precursor. Oh, that would have been so nice. Oh god! What does it look like anyway? I think I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's not that nice, is it? Um, right. Okay. Uh, using that. Rare and valuable. And that one. 
Nothing too amazing. Okay, so I've got a lot of rares there, and I've got an exotic, and we've just come to the last crucible box there, actually. Um, I'm going to open that one. So that's the exotic. Oh, right, okay. So that's the actual um, armor. Sorry. So you can select a piece of armor there with all the different stats. So that's pretty sweet, of course. So if you need any armor at the moment, I'm not sure what I need. So I'm not sure I really need to worry about that at the moment. So I'm actually going to leave that to the side. Going to go for the large rank up chest now. So they do give you, as you can see, five scrolls. Um, a Tome of Knowledge and five patchwork knapsacks. Now, even the leveling up um, scrolls are pretty good than themselves. So, you've got two chests there, you've got two XP levels, a load of scrolls of knowledge, and 20 just from completing like a whole track um, is pretty sweet. An extra two to XP levels as well. And you know, you're on your way, you're starting to get in there a bit. Um, especially if you're like me, I've got like 60 levels saved up. Uh, already, so I can already get another character to wait here without even touching PVE, um, and I can just go straight into World v World, which is what I pretty much love to do at the moment, which is quite cool. So I'm going to go through which boxes I'm going to go through now. Let's start with these patchwork knapsacks. See what we get. I'm not sure. I think it's just pretty much the same thing. Yeah, not getting really that lucky with these ones. Gasama, it's not too bad. These ones aren't that impressive. Whoa, what's that? Blast Master. Wow, that's a Harpoon gun. I've not seen that one before. That's interesting. Okay, cool. So there you go. We've got a new skin. Nice. <laughs> I'll bind it because I don't care. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sell it anyway. I want that. I want that skin. That's quite cool. Okay, not seen that before, so that's pretty nice. Um, not a complete bust. It, to, to be honest, with all this stuff you get anyway, it's just worth doing it. And I got a load of money. I should have really recorded how much money I got out of this. But here we go. We got 14 deluxe gearboxes. Still got a chance to get something pretty nice. Um, let's open. Actually, let's open these bags first, because then you know there's nothing much there. It's just crappy. Okay, more encore. Ancient bone, not too bad. Okay, so let's compact that. Um, do, 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 do. Any other boxes or anything there? No. Okay. I hate when you get to the end of this because I'm just like, oh. <laughs> I don't want to be disappointed. Let's get some stuff. Let's get something else epic. There you go. Another rare. Uh, pretty good. Drip of Karma. Molten Core. Da, 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 da. Come on! Oh! Oh! Now, this is a oh God! I've run out of space. <laughs> All right, let's de deposit some collectibles. Compact. Take that. Three left. Oh, okay, so we come to the end of that pretty much now, unfortunately. <laughs> Right, but we're going to review what I just got. So, Liquid Karma, I'm going to use that. I got a rare there. One rare. No rare there. So, rare exotic. And I got a couple of rares up here. Yeah, I got a rare there. Another exotic. Got a couple of rares which I've just missed as well. Still got these. Um, so that's a weapon box. So if you activate that, you can pick an uh, inquest weapon. So any of those stats that you want, of course, as well. And if you've not got the skins, um, then you can get that. It does actually tell you this where the skins unlocked as well. As it says uh, skins locked there for the uh, inquest dagger. So maybe I'll go for that. Um, that's another weapon box. So. You know, I can get another weapon box. Uh, sorry, another weapon out of that, which is pretty damn sweet. Um, I'm just going to get that to the side there. And do, 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 is that another weapon box? So I've got three weapon boxes. So that's pretty good. I mean, i got no idea. I've got so many of these boxes saved up now. It's just insane. I'm going to be able to gear up a guy completely across uh, all the dungeons as well. So, um, and remember, we do, of course, have the uh, armor armor set as well, so I'll pr 
probably more than likely just going to go for skins, really, because I don't really need gear that much, because stupidly I just geared up all my characters randomly, for completely forgetting that you can get all this stuff. So if you're not in any rush to gear up your characters, just go for these reward tracks, because they're really good. Um, for gearing up your characters, but guys, basically that's pretty much it. I mean, uh, you can sell all this, you can salvage it, you can get globs um, from the rares. Sorry, sell the exotics, get extra money. But I'll make. Uh, I'm not sure how much money I'll make from this. It just depends what I do with it. Um, I'm not 100% sure what I will do with it. Maybe I can get some extra luck. So see if the magic find counts um, towards my next. Um, next track which I've got ready already to open and I'm just gonna have to I want to wait and want to get some more videos up before actually uh, uploading the next one and getting that one done so thank you very much guys if you like the camera which is obviously here um, above my map just to add a little bit of extra something ness something ness yeah that'll do um, then drop a comment below otherwise thank you very much cheesy pointing there never done that before pointy point um thank you very much guys check me out twitter which is just above uh here there you go there Woo. at jebdan and i will see you very soon guys thank you very much for your support so far load more I build videos and uh, reward track videos and some podcasts coming up as well soon um so i will see you very soon thank you very much guys and see ya